What's going on, you guys? This is Master Teacher of Attraction. And in this video, I really wanted to get into the, the headspace of what y'all be talking about with this looks money status uh, stuff y'all be thinking. Okay. And why you push away building your physique. All right. And then we're going to go a little more. Wait, hold on. I might keep that for another video. But in this video, we're going to be discussing the why you should build your physique as opposed to this looks money status mentality. OK, so off the bat, uh, we operate in this realm within this vessel that we call a body. OK. And what we truly are is spirit. OK, if you look at the etymology of spirit, that means breath. So that means you are not your body. You are literally the spirit that powers this vessel, this vehicle and that spirit that we call is God. OK, now, if you don't understand what I just said or that just went over your head, then I can't help you. You should just shut off the video. OK, you probably think I'm on demon time or whatever. OK, but what I just said is the truth. All right. So if that is what is powering you and you are not your person, you're not your SSN, you're not the name that you were given. That's all a corporate fiction. Uh, that's a dead entity. That's a corporation. It's a SSN is just like an EIN. It's a business identification of it. OK, so now that you know that you are not the person, you are the spirit. But we also this is our vehicle that we operate in within this realm. Just like a vehicle, you have to maintain it. OK. And this vehicle is what attracts the opposite sex. And this is all throughout the animal kingdom, whether you show up in this world as an ant, whether you show up in this world as a lion a gorilla, a horse, a bull, all of those things, there's a male and female version of it. Okay, this is universal law. So within that universal law, on the male side, it's always about who is the healthier male. That healthier male is going to be the one that's going to be passing off the genes. OK, so if we know this is what happens in all the other species, then why is the most uh, supposedly the most smartest uh, species on planet Earth talking about fictitious things that has nothing to do with attracting the opposite sex? Does a gorilla talk about attracting the opposite sex with uh, uh, with money? Say today, gorillas start a, a, a civilization and talking about rocks as currency. And then they start gathering rocks. Guess what? They're not doing that. OK, it's all about the masculine traits because it's masculine energy within the males and it's feminine energy within the females. And each one has a little bit of the other to have some type of balance towards the opposite sex. OK, so. Humans are the only species talking about this foolishness and it has nothing to do with universal law. OK, now we do live in a man made construct. OK, so when it comes to these ideas. That's what other people do, but it's all about what's going on in your head. OK, especially if you're a man, if you are a man, listen to me closely. You are the chief. You can call yourself Chief Warhawk. I told you all about my uh, background. OK. I got Cherokee in my hair. You. You look at the accents in my hair. Look at the accents in my hair. Wait until I get my Indian cheeks back. 
Okay, <laughs> wait till I get some braids <laughs> or afro. I already got an afro pretty much, and it's just gonna get bigger. Okay, that's what's running through me. So I like to say, chief, think of yourself as a chief. What's gonna be happening in your in your domicile? For the people who don't know what a domicile is. That's pretty much your uh, dwelling, okay, where you dwell, your territory. What's going to happen in your territory? What are the rules and regulations of your territory, okay? And in order to establish that, just like the male gorilla, just like the male lion, your physique has to be on point. Your health has to be on point. If you're not healthy, you're not going to get those uh, female lions. You're not going to get those uh, female gorillas. And you're a human, so you're not going to get those uh, female humans. And this is why. Even if they even if they go after you for your money, uh, your looks as far... Because when y'all talk about looks, y'all be talking about stuff that you shouldn't be trying to change. Like your eyebrow arch and... Uh, your lining and and um, your your uh, bone structure within your your face, trying to look like handsome Squidward and all this, um, like stuff you have no control with your height and doing leg lengthening and surgery, like y'all messing yourself up. And guess what? Some of these females still gonna leave your ass. That's what y'all experiencing, right? They still don't leave you. And this is why it's so important to get the last damn guy to weight management. Because once you understand and you have the knowledge on how to keep your physique healthy, whenever your physique is healthy, it's going to look the part. You can't have a healthy physique and it not look the part. And it actually be able to do something. Okay. And that's going to look different for every dude. Okay. Just based on what we do. Like you got dudes, even when you look at bodybuilders, two different styles, you're going to get two different physiques. You got a bodybuilding body build. You got a powerlifting body build. You got a basketball player build. You got a soccer uh, body build. Okay. It's different body builds. But each one is conducive to what that man is doing within his life but the whole goal and, and the whole point i'm trying to say is the physique is healthy to be able to do each one of those things the body adapts to what you want it to do and what you are doing and it can only do that if it's healthy when it's not healthy it can't adapt and this is where you start to get diseases once you start to get these diseases, your health goes down. Once your health goes down, you're not attractive to the opposite sex. OK, and you should question any women that are attracted to you while you down. OK, I repeat, you should question whether uh, women are attracted to you and what they are attracted to you for. When you are not healthy. If you're looking at yourself in the mirror, you got uh, dark circles underneath your eyes, your hair falling out, you got a patchy beard, okay? You got a beard gut and all that. You know you got low energy and you got hypothyroidism. If you, if you got all these things and you know that and you feel that from within, it's going to show. And these women also know that too. This is why you got to understand why is she choosing me in this state? A lot of women pick uh, dudes that they can control. That's another bot on Tinder. Just ridiculous, man. Um, a lot of women pick dudes that they can control. A lot of women pick dudes that they look better than, i.e. look healthier. For vain reasons. Okay. So that's a no, whole nother video. Uh, about women. Uh, why you need to see why a woman is choosing you.
okay, after you get these results from the last damn guy to weight management, okay, and that's why I'm making these videos for people about what to expect after you get these results, because I already know my the last damn guy to weight management is going to get results because it's based on the truth, okay, so I'm making these videos so you guys understand life after, okay, um, and this is, you know, things from my experience and everything. Shoot, I just had, I remember when, so I got so many stories. <laughs> uh, it'd be even women right now. And this is why, you know, I'm healthy. Um, asking about, you know, treating me like every other dude. And I just told it straight up because my an my anima, which, which is remember that 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 portion, that smaller portion of a male I was talking about is feminine, so it can balance be in balance with a female of the opposite sex. That's your anima. Okay, you can also look it up for a deeper perspective, but that's my gut. That's connected to my gut feeling. And my gut feeling or anima told me about this woman. It said, she wants you for your money. So I just asked her straight up. I don't want to give you any money, but uh, let me go ahead and ask you this. Is that what you're pretty much coming to me for? To try to, you know, try to do me like every other dude. Like I'm just up in your rap or something like that. Like I'm like a black widow in your, uh, some prey, some, uh, like a bug that just flew into your web of a black widow female black widow is she like yeah um uh why do you think that you're not a good client or a good candidate for pretty much my business you know selling pusoir uh and me saying that i'm not a good client because i don't do that uh and she just straight up said yeah that's what i'm doing so that's why you always got to ask so just imagine how women are doing when they kind of see, oh, this is sucker right here. He look like a dude that can pay my bills. Let me throw him a couple of shoes and see. That's something else I got to make a video about too. Uh, relying solely on shoes and signals. Because I'm telling you guys, after you get your physique right and start feeling healthy and start getting energy, that's going to start to permeate in your aura. Okay. This is metaphysical stuff that I'm talking about. So, so, so some of y'all may not even know what's going on when it comes to that, but it don't mean that it ain't real and it ain't going on. Some of y'all don't believe in the most high, but the most high believe in you. <laughs> Remember what I said at the beginning of this video, talking about what spirit is and what you think you are is not you and what you truly are. Okay? So... Before I say this, shout out to Mr. Lucario, and the truth is inside you. So hopefully you don't let that go over your head too. But this is just, you know, for some perspective on um, why it's important to focus more on your physique and what your physique represents. In the Bible, it says the kingdom of God is within. What is this temple within? It also said the body is the temple. So if your inner world is screwed up, even if the women like you at 260 pounds, it'd be some big dudes getting some women out here. I ain't saying that ain't happening. But why? Why? Would she still like you if you was at your ideal body weight? Is she going to start throwing little comments? I need you to put on some more weight. I like you like that. Then you got to start asking some questions. Why does she want me like that? When you just had a damn heart attack. At that weight, you got to ask yourself these questions. Why would you go back to that weight? From some, for some pusua, from a woman that wants you in a weaker state. Come on, come on. We don't do that. We don't do that. And I hope, hopefully, I explained thoroughly with the, this perspective on why. Okay, it's more important than just looks and all that and your money and all that you shouldn't be leading with that stuff anyway because y'all think women are dumb they're very smart they know what they're doing out here so you got to be on your p's and q's
If you want to be out here like Boo Boo the Fool that was just born yesterday, they're going to find that out and they're going to treat you accordingly. All right. So, again, this is why you should focus on your physique and within that physique, focus on your health and not too many things outside of that. Because once you start focusing that, then you can start putting your physique in different areas and see. Because that's pretty much your bait. Your health is a signal to the environment that I am viral, uh, that uh, my virility and my fertility is at an optimal point to reproduce. And you want to see which women respond to that. OK, and that's a different video. I'll holler at y'all at a different video. Y'all don't forget to check out the last damn guy to weight management the description box. We also got other paid videos and uh, courses on different things when it comes to the whole totality of this uh, thing that we call life and game. All right. Talk to you on another video. So if you want to stop getting lied to about weight loss, nutrition, anything about it, remember to hit that like button down beneath this video. Go purchase the course if you want it all in an organized fashion so you ain't got to look all over my channel for the information or if you don't want to do that go ahead and watch another video on my channel and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell